guys, what's going on? Potter Pop Hunter here, back again with another unboxing video. This time I have a Harry Potter exclusive, or Hot Topic exclusive. This is Harry Potter with his H sweater that he got from the Weasleys, or from Mrs. Weasley, who made it for him. Um, this one is one of my harder to find pops that I've been looking for on my list. I pretty much have all of the common Harry Potter pops and Fantastic Beasts pops, so the ones I'm looking for now are the ones that are a little bit higher in price or the ones that were the exclusives. Um, most of the Harry Potter pops that I have or that I'm actually looking for on my list uh, are not super expensive. I think the most expensive is the Luna Lovegood with um, the Spectro, Spectro Specs and then the three pack of the animals from Harry Potter. I think it's the Grindelo, the Mandrake, and the Pixie. Um, those run for about 110 I think, to $130. So, in the grand scheme of things, some pops are a lot more expensive. Like the Game of Thrones ones, I think, are something ridiculous. Like one of the Ned Stark ones is probably about $2,000. So I'm glad the Harry Potter ones haven't become that expensive yet, um, or if ever, so that I can still get these because I want to complete the set. Um, like I said, this is um, Harry Potter. This is number 27. This is Harry Potter with the sweater. Um, and as you can see in the back here, the other ones in um, numerical order are Ron Weasley with the sweater. Um, then we also have Bellatrix Lestrange with her Azkaban robes. And then also Lucius Malfoy with the Death Eater mask. Um, these three are ones that I'm definitely looking to add to my collection. So I'm always on the lookout for them. Uh, this one I actually purchased on eBay. So I got lucky and won the auction on this one. Um, came in right about what uh, the Funko app has this pop valued at. So... Um, with shipping, I maybe paid a little bit more, but I was happy to add it to the collection because this is, again, one that I was looking for. Um, but thought I would share it with you guys and um, take it out of the box. Um, this is a pop from 2016, so it is, like I said, a little bit harder to find. Um, these ones um, definitely won't be able to find at Hot Topic anymore. So um, usually like Mercari or eBay um, are probably the best bet to be able to find these guys. So... Let's go ahead and take a look at Harry out of the box. And here he is. And it's a normal standard Harry. Really the only difference is he does have the sweater on with the H that he got from for Christmas from the Weasley family. Um, so that is really cool. Um, he's a little bit shorter because this is um, earlier in the series. So he's not as tall as a regular pop or some of the later ones. So... Again, this one is pretty cool. Glad to have him in the collection. Um, the pop and the box both came in pretty good condition. Again, for a pop that was from 2016. Um, glad to see that it came in good shape. Um, buying on eBay, the pictures only tell part of the story, so it's nice when you always get a good pop that um, you don't have any concerns with the box or the pop itself. Um, but let me know what you think, guys. On this pop, definitely going to be looking for the Ron with the sweater to kind of complete these two. Um, and then looking to complete the other ones in the rest of the set. Um, but otherwise, guys, as always, thanks for watching. If you like the content, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button. Uh, if you like the content and want to see more, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Otherwise, thanks for watching and have a good day.